Hi guys, welcome back to Enigma Review. So today I'm going to do cheap, affordable Halloween items from Poundland. Yep, got that right, Poundland. Home Bargains and a teeny weeny B&M. Only a small haul guys, so let's get straight into it. Let's start with what's on my head. So guys, I went into Poundland today. It's been the first time I've been in for a while. The store had completely changed and I was a little bit like lost. But as I went in there, they did start putting their Halloween items out. Not all of it, but a lot of it was on there that I liked and I grabbed. One of them was this fat headband and I just thought, I got to have a bit of that. It was a pound. They did have various other headbands as well, guys. Um, I can't quite remember what they had. I think they had some pumpkin ones as well, which I might go back and get for Zach. Um, I will be dipping in and out of Poundland for the next couple of weeks anyway, or should I say the next month or so. So this was a pound, guys. And then on that section, I picked up not one, but two ghosties. So these are ceramic and um, these seem a little bit thicker than the usual ones I get. I think these are more of a matte than um, the shine sheer that they normally do. I do collect these every year. I've got pumpkins, I've got cats, I've got all kinds of things and I just wanted to grab these two. They're quite solid these ones guys. I thought these were really worth a pound each. So I grabbed two of them. Um, they did have pussycat ones as well, but I think last year I grabbed the cats, so I didn't want to grab the cats again. I've already got two pumpkins. I think I've got everything that I need. If they did do two witches, I'd probably grab two witches. Then I've got the whole set of what I need. So that was them, guys. So that was two pounds. This is all Poundland. Straight into um, Poundland, I also picked up a spooky projector. Um, I normally get these for Zach, to be honest with you guys, and I just thought... We'll get it for the living room. I do have an actual projector, but um, I may be putting that on the backdrop here. I don't know. I might do it in the front room. I just don't like Zach looking into it because it's quite a lasered one. This was only a pound, guys, and it just says spooky projector. It takes three AA batteries. I completely forgot batteries, so I've had to rummage through my house just for batteries for these. But please remember to get batteries. So there's not going to be any in there to show you guys, but... I may just grab some batteries and give you a demonstration um, sometime on Instagram or so forth or Facebook. But it's just plain plastic. It's cheap tap really guys, but for kids they absolutely love it. And it's got bats, happy Halloween, pumpkins, cats, all kinds of things on there. So that was that guys. I'm going to put that back in the box because obviously it's not till Halloween. Then I also picked up two lanterns. So... Let me just put this one here for the camera to see. Now, they only had one of the witchy one left and I was really like bummed out because I really wanted to get two of the witchy ones rather than the two like raven ones. But I may just find them in the other shop when I go and grab another one of the witch and another one of the raven put two in my porch and put two in my living room these are fantastic these were three pound each guys you probably won't see it too well with the lights shining back but at, in that time they're quite like noticeable at night the candle is a battery operated it's three AAA AAA um, I literally had to empty all my remotes to get the batteries for these because it completely blew my mind that I had to get batteries for all of these things. It just didn't even enter my head. So that was the witchy one. So this is Lantern with Candle and it's the LED flickering flame. I have a lot of these flickering flame candles and they are really, really good. So I got one, which is the witchy one. Let me put that one back there. And then the other one that I got just has the raven or should i say the crow on it and then again i put batteries in that they are a little bit scuffed guys and a little bit i don't know a bit scratched and so forth but what do you want for three quid i wasn't too bothered about it guys to be honest with you they're only for halloween decoration if i really like them i'll keep them all year round because that's what i tend to do with a lot of my decor from tk maxx Poundland I tend to put away at the um, at the end of um, October, around about first week of November, but we'll see. Now guys, I also um, picked up a pair of fishnets. 
<laughs> I don't know why I grabbed these. I, I just don't have much luck when it comes to fishnet stockings or fishnet tights. The last pair that I got from eBay, if you remember, I bought some fishnet tights. They were quite small, guys, and my finger went through the the top part where you pull them up and I ripped them all. And they'll be good to use on my arms for some kind of dress. But these are large. They had small and medium. They were a pound. They also had skeleton tights, like that kind of thing. I've got a lot of like gothic alternative tights. I just wanted a pair of fishnets and they were a pound, a lot cheaper than eBay. So I grabbed them, guys. Um, so that was pound shop. Everything here was pound shop. I did buy a few other things, guys, but they're not relevant to like being goth. So I haven't added them into the video. I did then run across to um, Home Bargains. They didn't have a lot of stuff in there. I really wanted the candles, the Wickford & Co. Mm. I buy them every year, guys. I buy, I think I buy about six for Halloween and I buy about eight for Christmas and I could not find any. They had lots of Christmas ones in, no Halloween ones. So I'm sending my dad on a mission next week. Hi, dad, love you. You know where, you know where you're going next week to see if he can find him because he seems to have better luck than I do. So the only thing I picked up from um, the range guys was this haunted house, three meter pumpkin bunting. I already have this already and I've got lots of other stuff decoration wise, but I just thought I'll get some more. Maybe this year I'll put this in the porch maybe. I tend to decorate the porch and then I decorate the living room as well for Zach. So this was something like 69p. They had some different decorations there but I like it and I just thought it, it will do. Now, I didn't pick anything else apart from that in Home Bargains, apart from other stuff, which I'm not gonna put in my video today, but I did run across the B&M, had a quick look in theirs. Again, not much in there. I think they're just starting to put things out as far as Halloween in both. I think the range have got quite more stuff in but i'm quite far out from the range so i will probably wait till i go to rochdale and then i will go in the range if you want me to vlog any of these videos when i go to rochdale bottoms mill tk max the range home bargain and b&m let me know in the comment below and i will get that done for you last but not least i grabbed these two little they had these in i think four different colors so they had orange purple silver and i think they had red these were two pound each guys there were a lot left in there now this is b m but i grabbed them quickly because a few people was hanging around them and all it was is pulled the tab out and they just i don't know if you'll be able to see it guys but they are just lit up and it just says led lantern two pound each now when you think about it i paid two pound for one of these and three pound for one of these Sometimes it, it does fare to, to grab things like this in the pound shop rather than being m and home bargains. But for two pound or four, I like them, I'll grab them. I like the purple and I got the orange. And that is it guys, that is all I grabbed at the moment. I will be doing a lot more of the decor for Halloween. Um, I will be going to TK Maxx quite a lot. I will be going into the range. So stay with me guys if you've come on my channel and you're wondering what's going on i am doing the run up to halloween i will do as many videos as i can with enough stuff in to fit in for my 10 minutes and if you want to come and join me hit the sub i ain't gonna cut that out because i ain't got time hit the subscribe button <laughs> and hit the notification bell so you can see when i upload guys at the minute i am only doing two days a week which is wednesday and saturday outfit of the week will be ending soon guys so get sharing get commenting and um, let me know any ideas you've got for outfits that you want me to throw in before i end this i do have some halloween outfits that i'm going to put on my channel just for the fun of it because you know we have to do that and don't forget the bat the bat headband a pound all right guys take care of yourself and i'll see you on my next one happy halloween coming soon bye for now don't forget to hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell and hit that like button if you like this video because it helps me out and my channel. Take care guys and I'll see you on my next one. Bye for now.